Microsoft just dropped something massive. I'm talking about a platform that puts the power of OpenAI, Anthropic, and a dozen other AI models right at your fingertips. No crazy technical skills needed. This thing lets you build AI apps and agents that can actually run businesses. Most people have no idea this exists yet, and the ones who do are already figuring out how to turn this into serious money. Today I'm showing you exactly what Microsoft Foundry is, how it works, and the real ways you can capitalize on it before everyone else catches on. Hey there, so if you haven't already noticed, I'm Nick Ponte's AI avatar. While the real Nick is busy helping businesses with Mina Marketing, Hawaii's fastest growing marketing agency, I'm here dropping the latest AI hacks, tools, and money-making strategies. The real Nick reads every single comment on these videos, so make sure you comment below. And listen, if you're serious about landing some AI subscription-based customers, grab my four-part AI fast track training that I am currently offering for free. The link's in the description. Okay, so here's what you need to know. Microsoft Foundry is basically a giant factory for building AI apps and agents. Instead of needing to be some genius programmer, Microsoft just said, here's everything in one place. You get access to models from OpenAI, Anthropic, Meta, Mistral, DeepSeek, and others, all in one spot. It's built on Azure, which is Microsoft's cloud platform. You get model catalogs, agent frameworks, tools, security, and monitoring all baked in. The whole thing lives at ai.azure.com. Here's the thing most people miss. This isn't just another AI playground. This is infrastructure for building actual businesses. You can create AI agents that handle customer service, build apps that process documents, and set up systems that run workflows without human involvement. Let me tell you why you're seeing this video at exactly the right time. And I mean this. Most people still don't know what Microsoft Foundry is. Microsoft just rebranded their whole AI studio ecosystem into this new platform. The announcement happened recently, and the average person has no clue this exists yet. That means you're literally in the first wave of people who can position themselves as experts on this platform. Think about when ChatGPT first came out. The people who jumped on it early and started building services around it, they're eating right now. Same thing here, except this is bigger because you're not limited to one model. You've got access to everything. And here's what makes this even more interesting. Businesses are desperate for AI solutions, but they're scared to build them. They don't have the technical teams. They don't know which models to use. They're worried about security and compliance. Microsoft Foundry solves all of that, which means if you understand how this platform works, you can position yourself as the bridge between businesses that need AI and the technology that delivers it. All right, so let's break down how this thing is structured. At the top level, you've got a Foundry resource. That's your container in Azure that handles permissions, security, and network settings. Inside that, you create projects. These are workspaces where you actually build stuff. Each project can have its own models, data connections, and agents. The model catalog is where things get interesting. You can browse dozens of different AI models. GPT-4 from OpenAI, Claude from Anthropic, open source models like Llama or Maestral, you can test different models, compare outputs, and pick what works best. Then you've got the agent builder. Configure AI agents that can actually do tasks. Give them access to tools, connect them to your data, deploy them into Microsoft Teams, custom web apps, or your own systems. The agents you build can actually go to work. Look, I need to be real with you for a second. A few years ago, I was working full-time as a mechanic, covered in grease every day, trading hours for dollars. And I'm not saying there's anything wrong with that work, but I wanted something different. I wanted to build something that could grow without being limited by how many hours I could physically work. And tools like what we're talking about today, this is exactly what changed everything for me. Learning how to leverage AI platforms, how to build systems, how to create value for businesses using technology, that's what let me transition from wrenching on cars to running a marketing agency and building an online education business. I'm not special. I just learned how these tools work and figured out how to apply them in ways that solve real problems for real businesses. If you're finding this valuable, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe. The real Nick Ponte reads every comment on these videos, so drop a comment below. And hey, if you're serious about taking your business to the next level, grab my four-part AI fast track training that I'm currently offering for free. It also includes an exclusive link to try out the AI software I use in my business for 30 days free. The link's in the description. Okay, so now let's talk about what actually matters. How do you turn knowledge of Microsoft Foundry into money? Real strategies, not silly stuff, serious business opportunities. First option, become an implementation specialist. Businesses want AI but need someone to build it. You position yourself as the person who takes their needs and builds custom solutions on Foundry. Maybe a company needs an AI assistant that answers customer questions using their documentation. You build that, train it on their data, deploy it, and charge a setup fee plus monthly maintenance, $2,000 to $5,000 for setup, and $300 to $3,000 per month ongoing. Second option, create and sell AI-powered tools. Build an AI agent that helps real estate agents qualify leads. Build it once on Foundry, then sell access as a subscription. $25 to $99 per month per user. 10 real estate agents signed up is $250 to $990 monthly recurring. 
Scale to 100 users and you're looking at serious income. Third option, offer consulting and training. Once you understand Foundry, teach other people. Companies pay for training sessions. Entrepreneurs pay for consulting. You can create courses. The knowledge itself becomes the product. And because this platform is so new, there's almost no competition in the education space. Fourth option, build vertical specific solutions. Pick an industry like dental practices. Learn what dental offices need from AI. Then build solutions specifically for that market using Foundry. Patient intake automation, appointment reminders, insurance verification, you become the go-to AI solution provider for that entire vertical. That's how you build a real business with moats around it. Here's where most people mess up with new platforms like this. Let me break down the common mistakes so you don't waste your time. Mistake number one, they try to learn everything before doing anything. They watch a hundred tutorials. They read all the documentation. Wrong. You need to know enough to solve one specific problem, then learn more as you go. Progress beats perfection. Mistake number two, they build solutions looking for problems. They create some cool AI thing because it's technically impressive, then try to find someone who needs it. That's backwards. Start with the problem, find businesses with a pain point, then build a solution that fixes that specific pain. Mistake number three, they compete on price. They think the way to win is charging less than everyone else. That's a race to the bottom. You win by delivering better results, understanding the business better, making implementation easier. The businesses that care most about price are usually the worst clients. Mistake number four, they don't think about ongoing value. They build something once, deliver it, and that's it. The real money is in recurring relationships. Build systems that need monitoring, updating, and improving. Create packages where you're continuously adding value. That's how you build predictable income instead of constantly chasing new projects. So here's how you actually get started with Microsoft Foundry if you wanna turn this into income. First, go to ai.azure.com and explore the interface. You don't need an Azure account just to browse. Click around, look at the model catalog, check out example projects, get familiar with what's possible. When you're ready to build something, you will need an Azure subscription. The Foundry platform itself is free. You only pay for actual services you use, models, storage, compute, and you can start small. Test things without spending a fortune. Here's my advice. Pick one specific use case and build it. Don't try to master the entire platform. Just pick one thing, maybe an AI assistant that answers questions based on company documentation. Build that get it working, then find a business that needs exactly that. Show them what you built, offer to customize it. That first win teaches you more than a month of tutorials and use the Visual Studio Code extension if you code. If you don't code, the web portal is powerful. You can build a lot just using the visual interface. The point is to start doing, not just learning. Let me tell you something. The fact that you're watching this video right now is not an accident. You could be anywhere else on the internet. You could be scrolling through shorts or watching entertainment, but you're here, learning about a platform that 99% of people don't even know exist yet. That tells me something about you. You're not looking for easy, you're looking for real. You understand that opportunities don't come from doing what everyone else is doing. They come from being early, from learning what matters before it becomes obvious to everyone. And this is one of those moments. Microsoft Foundry is going to be huge. The question is whether you're going to be one of the people who was here at the beginning or someone who shows up late when it's already crowded. I genuinely believe that some of you watching this are going to build legitimate businesses using this platform. Not because it's magic, but because you're the type of person who takes action on good information. You see the opportunity, you put in the work, and you figure it out as you go. That's how real businesses get built. Microsoft Foundry is a powerful platform. It gives you access to the best AI models in the world. It provides the infrastructure to build real applications. And it's accessible enough that you don't need to be a software engineer to use it. But knowing about it doesn't matter if you don't do anything with that knowledge. The opportunity is there. Businesses need AI solutions. They need people who can bridge the gap between what's possible and what's practical. They need implementation. They need training. They need ongoing support. And if you position yourself correctly, you can build a real income stream by being that bridge. Start with one thing. Build one solution, help one business, then scale from there. That's the path. It's not complicated, but it does require you to actually start. If you found this valuable, I've got something for you. My four-part AI fast track training goes way deeper on how to land high paying AI clients and build subscription-based income. It's free and it includes a 30 day free trial of the exact software platform I use to run my entire business. The link is in the description below. Also join my free community over 22,000 AI and marketing agency owners sharing what's working right now. Links in the description and pinned in the comments. And seriously, drop a comment below. Tell me what you're planning to build, what industry you're thinking about targeting. The Real Nick reads every single comment. We're building something special here and I wanna hear from you. All right, that's it for today. Now go build something. I'll see you in the next one.